guys, how are you doing? It's your girl Grace, aka Face Quizit, and today we're going to be recreating this gorgeous look that I'm wearing. And oh my god, my eyes are just sparkling. Can you see this? Let me zoom in just in case you have one. Oh my god, look at that. Oh god. How gorgeous is that? I mean, seriously, ladies, how gorgeous is that? Huh? Oh wow, beautiful. If I can say so myself. Yes, and I do say so myself. <laughs> anyway, my divas, this is the look for today. This look is for New Year's Eve, as I promised you in my last video, that I will be creating a look for New Year, you know, party season, you know. Um, this is the look that I promise. Yes, I know I've been doing a lot of sparkles lately, but why not? It's that part, it's that time of the year. It's the season to be jolly, okay? So, um, yeah, I think that this will be a fantastic look for New Year's Eve, you know, if you're going out with your girls on New Year's Eve, if you get to going to church like myself to go get your praise on, hey man, then, you know, it's New Year's Eve, why not? I mean, in my church, we always have a concert afterwards and I wanna be looking all kinds of fabulous. So, hey, this is the look for, for you, okay? So if you want to learn how I created this fabulous look, then do stay tuned. So I've already prepped and primed my eye. So the first thing I'm taking, I'm digging into it with a cotton board because uh, a chunk of it broke into the lid. Uh, but it's a black bean by a NYX Jumbo Stick in black bean. And I'm just applying that all over my lid. I'm taking my orange matte uh, Oh gosh, now I've applied too much. Oh my goodness, what's going on today? I just wanted a teeny weeny bit of that. Ugh, dusting it off the brush. Okay, and I'm blending that all over my, above my, my crease, like so. Next thing I'm taking is my Ben Nye, no, sorry, not Ben Nye, Cryolan powder. Um, eyeshadow in light brown. Oh, I don't know if you can see it. It's this one right here. It looks really dark, but it's not that dark. This camera is not doing it just but yeah, this is it. That color right there. Any brown would do a light brown. Oh, great. This is what happens when you don't follow the order of things. Okay, so I'm applying my brown into my crease, like so. All right, next thing I'm going to be taking, is, well, I'm going to now spread out this uh, next jumbo pencil, as this would have been the right time to apply it. So, just blending it out a little bit. I would normally apply with a brush, but um, I got a huge chunk of it break into the lid and I had to scoop it out with this cotton bud, so. Okay, so the next thing I'm taking now is um, a MAC pigment called Dark Horse. Looks like that, I've deported all mine, so look at all those cute little glitters in there. So I'm applying that all over my lid. So I'm taking a flat brush. This is a face exquisite, um, one of the face exquisite flat brushes. And I'm just taking a bit of that dark horse and I'm applying that all over my, all over the black bean that I had applied earlier. Oh my, yeah, that's right. Over the black bean, which is the dark, the jet black base that I had on. Now I'm just going to take a socket brush and fan out the crease, the, the end bit or the, let's fade it out basically anyway, the edges. Like so. Okay. 
Okay, so now I'm taking this um, Snooki's official twin um, glitter bullet. It comes in like a syringe. And I think this one is called Diamond Dog. I can't remember. It's not written on the on the, the syringe. Um, and for this particular, normally I like to mix my glitters with some mixing medium of some sort. But for this particular one, I'm applying it direct, as you can see, as I've done um, on the other eye, because I don't want it to. I want it to be dry, but still have that color. And this is for my personal use. I have one for my kit. So I'm just going to dip this and place all over my eye like so. And I'm just going to go back and forth and apply more of the glitter as I go along. And I absolutely love these glitters. And you just apply it, I've applied it dry. I haven't mixed it with anything. No mixing medium, nothing. Just applied it as it is all over the dark horse. And this is what it looks like. And as you know, I'm a sucker for blending. So I need to just tidy that bit up. I like everything to look neat. So I'm just gonna fade that bit out a little bit more, like so. And it's very, very easy, because this is basically it. See, look at that, isn't that gorgeous? I mean, look at the other eye, absolutely stunning. And I haven't had to do too much, okay? So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to go and line my eyes and um, apply my four slashes and I'll come and show you the finished look and talk to you through the rest of my face. So I've applied my lashes and um, once again, um, I've left my under eye bare because, you know, this is quite a dark color and because um, my eyes are so small, if I were to make them look too smoky, then it just closes up my eyes. Um, so it does, you know, the serious smoky eye does not work for me to be quite honest. I do do it on clients, but on myself, it just doesn't work. I do it sometimes, but yeah, very rarely. So anyway, um, yeah, so this is the final look. I am loving this. Let me zoom up there just a little bit so you can really see. Can you see that? Oh my God. Hoo, 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 hoo. I'm in glitter heaven. Oh my goodness. Look at that. How beautiful is that? This look is perfect for New Year's Eve. Going out with the girls. This is the look. Okay. I love it. I really do. Um, yeah. So... This is it, ladies. I hope you like it. So I'm going to talk you through what I've got on on the rest of my face. On my lips, I'm wearing... Um, I've lined my lips with Current by MAC. And I've worn... Um, I'm wearing Diva lipstick, which is also by MAC. And on top of that, I've got a gloss by MAC called Desire. Um, and that's what I've got on my lips. On my cheeks, I've got um, apricot sorbet from the um, makeup store on. And on my face today, I'm wearing the um, MAC Studio Fix Fluid in NC45 and also um, MAC Select Sheer Powder in NC45. And I'm, I've got a lot of highlighting and contouring going on there, if you can see. But I'll do a separate video for you on that. So there you have it, my divas. I hope you like it. I hope you've enjoyed um, this tutorial as much as I've enjoyed recording it. I really love this look. Let me just zoom in one more time so you can have another look. Oh my God, look at that. Isn't that just gorgeous? Sparkling. Oh my God.
Oh wow, I love it. Sorry, I know I keep saying it. No, I'm not sorry actually. I do love it. It's absolutely stunning and I'm sure you love it too. Yeah, so there you have it my divas. Remember to comment if you have any um, and also subscribe to my channel. It's very important that you subscribe to this channel please if you want me to keep doing um, tutorials. I would really really appreciate that. Um, also, you know, I'd appreciate it if you can go and um, follow me on Instagram because like I said in my last video there are a couple of pictures that I put out there but which I have not been able to do a video for I don't always have time to do videos so you know um, in order not to miss anything also subscribe to me on Instagram and also follow me sorry follow me on Instagram subscribe to me on YouTube so anyway, divas, I'm wishing you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year in advance. And maybe I will, maybe I won't. We'll see how it goes. I might just throw another look out there before the end of the year. Um, if I don't do a video, then there'll definitely be pictures, but I will try and do another video. If I don't get to do it and I don't get to speak to you, my darlings, do have a Merry Christmas and a prosperous New Year. Love you, divas. God bless. Bye. Mwah. Love you. Bye-bye. All my ladies, all my ladies, don't say, don't say, take a look, where they got it.